Hey, Pastor Steve Waldron, I hope you're having a great day in Jesus. My wife sent me this article, Sister Waldron, the other day from Folk Life, Louisiana, and it's about uh, hair in the Pentecostal tradition. Of course, last statistics we had, uh, eight plus percent of the state of Louisiana was United Pentecostal, and that doesn't include all the other types of Pentecostalism out there. But, uh, and it was written by Vondely Hatcher, who I'm thinking that is brother and sister Hatcher. That was my wife and I's pastor for part of the time we were in Jackson College of Ministry. Wonderful, wonderful people. And uh, brother Hatcher is brother Bernard, David Bernard's brother-in-law. So this would be brother Bernard's niece, if I'm doing that correctly. This is a great, great article on ladies' hair. And it goes into the Ziegler's. I graduated with Mike Ziegler, who now pastors uh, Loretta Bernard and uh, her husband's church in Gonzales, Louisiana. Last I heard, Brother Mike was a painter for many years. And he married Doretha Moore, who Brother Moore her dad was the principal at Jackson Christian School when I was there. And Doretha, she always had the distinct uh, uh, honor, privilege of having like the biggest poofs, they used to call them, at Jackson College of Ministries. But they're just wonderful people. And one of the neat things as you get down to the bottom of this article is there is a couple of scholarly resources that I really want to get, like the Novum Testamentum. Uh, we'll get down to the bottom, see if I can show those to you down here. The sources where just cuts to the chase. And so I'm wondering if finally in the scholarly realm they're coming back to understanding 1 Corinthians 11 as referring to hair. And when I say coming back, that was universally the understanding for over a millennia. And it's just in America since the 1950s to avoid persecution that that's stopped. So that's just a great little article, and it's under louisianafolklife.org, and uh, Care Culture Among Generational Apostolic Pentecostal Women by Vondely Hatcher. You may not be Pentecostal, you're probably not watching this, but you'd really like this. It's cool. God bless. Talk with you later in Jesus' name.